All right, today we're going to be building the C++ bindings for Godot. So go to GitHub, and we're just going to download a couple things, uh, compile, and that's it. Should be a pretty quick video. So search for Godot CPP in GitHub, and then download the zip file. And then search for Godot headers, and make sure you search all GitHub and download them. And then we're done downloading things. So then move your download zips to wherever you want the actual C++ bindings to be and extract the zip files. And then for you can delete those zip files after. Uh, for the new bindings, you need to copy the headers over to the C++ bindings. They have a Godot headers folder in there now. And then you should have your just C++ master and inside of it, Godot headers with all the files from there. And then you can delete your download folders or zip files too. And then we'll run a command prompt and we're gonna be using SCON, so you need to have that installed. Go to your directory that the Godot C++ bindings are in. And you should in the uh, in the folder that you're going to compile from, you should have a S construct file. So here we're in the CPP master folder, and then we can type in scons platform equals windows and generate bindings equals yes. And then it will compile for a minute or two. We no longer need to specify how many bits and everything else that'll detect things from your system. So. Then if you want a release build as well, and not just the debug build we just did, you will do a target equals release. And again, it'll take a minute or two or even 10 possibly if you have a slower computer to compile this. And then we are done. And just make sure in your C++ bindings folder, in your bin folder there, that you have your, your libraries. And that's it.